Holger here is also sharing a chart on how Bitcoin is starting to rise because liquidity is beginning to you know, run back into the market. So it's the liquidity stupid. Bitcoin usually follows the US M2 monetary supply trend. Now Bitcoin has already risen, although the money supply trend has not yet turned. Now this is really key and what he is actually missing is what some other analysts have already picked up is that uh, China's M2 was expanding for the last few months. Also global M2 has been expanding for the last um, few months. So that just means um, the monetary supply globally, a lot of central banks are just printing like crazy, trying to do whatever or get in front of a lot of the issues that they're facing. Uh, the US is the last one to turn. Uh, so Bitcoin's already running on those other factors in my opinion. And when the US does turn, um, when the M2 begins to expand, um, quite significantly, uh, expect much, much higher prices for a lot of these assets. So, um, you know, again, you can focus a lot on interest rates and, and rate rises, which we have been over the last year, it's been very, very important. But now I think the main focus that we need to be locked on is liquidity. If the liquidity is coming back, then rate rises, inflation rate, it doesn't matter because that's that system that we know is broken and it's going to have to sort itself out. But the liquidity, the money is coming back in the market and they're looking for places that they can put their money uh, that won't get debased. Uh, it's not tied to you know bonds that are now suspect.